Tight Putt fam. Out here getting it cracking on a Saturday morning, 7.50 a.m. We're set to start our job at 8 a.m. We're going to be doing the outside of three properties, um, three residential properties. We're um, working for a landlord today, and she wants all three of these properties cleaned. And lucky for us, they're all within a block radius of each other. They're pretty much all neighbors, so we're going to go bang these out. Uh, $850 payday. Hopefully we can knock this out in about eight hours max. Let's get it. So you guys were watching the other day. You saw we lost a screw. It's just this little one that needs to go in there. It's about the third time it's happened. They just get loose over time. I'm going to go ahead and tighten this one down too. Put this one in and then we'll get all set up. Went ahead, took the screens out. Some of them need to be unlatched. So we asked the resident who lives here to unlatch them for us. Uh, we're going to get started water feeding building number one. Come back, remove the remainder of the screens and then water feed that next building all right so people were asking me how we deal with cleaning oxidized frames and i'm going to show you guys all we're going to do is scrub the frame a little more than we normally would now when cleaning oxidized frames you'll be able to see that white milky water dripping from the frame onto the glass you're just going to want to scrub the frame nice and hard long enough till you see the water turn from milky white to clear the homeowner is not here at the moment, so we're going to use our ladder and sneak up onto there and do those windows, get that out of the way so we don't have to get up there anymore today. And then we'll start water feeding the rest of the house. Not too bad at all. Another boring clip of me cleaning windows in fast motion with our water fed pole system. I got the zero pure, got the 50 foot pole. It's actually cut down to about 30 feet right now, I think. And um, I love it. Water fed pole, baby. Let's not forget about that Tucker Boarhead brush either. Need that. Only about three hours in, we're already done with two of the buildings. We have building number three left. We'll wash all the screens and then we'll get out of here. In the middle of the job, I did start to laugh at myself a little bit. This is my second time on this job site. The first time around, I cleaned all these windows traditionally and no exaggeration, it took me about 12 hours. If you stick around to the end, you'll see how long it took me today, but it was nowhere near 12 hours. This video is just a really good example of when and how to put a water fed pole to work. It's jobs like these where the water fed pole system is going to save you a ton of time and energy. It's so much less stressful and tedious and you get the exact same results, a perfectly clean window. I use the Zero Pure water fed pole system. I got the 50 foot pole with the Tucker Boarhead brush and I absolutely love this system. I'll be sure to leave you guys a link in the description. We're killing it today. Four and a half hours in, windows are done. Phone's almost dead. We're gonna clean the screens with our zero screen cleaner and uh, we'll be out of here. Woo, on the hustle today. Took us six hours, we made 850 bucks. So we averaged about $140 an hour. It seems to be um, what I can max out on hourly with the water fed pole system. Um, this is a, another perfect example of a situation where you're gonna wanna have a water fed pole. I use the Zero Pure. I'll be sure to leave that link in the description. And it was a killer day, man. Hope you guys are enjoying these videos and I'll see you next time.